Boys, girls, cats, and squirrels, what is going on? My name is Sully Salty, and welcome to the finale of the IBA Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Tag Lock. In case you haven't seen the rest of the series, pause the, visio the video, go to the description. There's a playlist down there with everybody's video that's taken part in this Tag Lock. In case you don't know the guys of the rest of the Tag Lock, it's everybody from the IBA, also known as the International Battle League. In case you don't know who I am, like I just said, my name is Slightly Salty, and most of you probably don't know who I am, because you're coming from the other guys' channels to watch this finale. Well, I'm actually the commissioner of the IBA, I'm the one that founded the league, reached out to them on Twitter, well, posted a tweet on Twitter, and kind of, like, slid into a couple of their DMs, been like, hey, making a series, yada yada yada, would you like, I'm making a draft league, would you like to join? And, yeah, found some guys. Found quite a few guys. A couple of them dipped, though. But that's okay. Maybe they'll even come back for Season 2. Um, but, yeah. Because Season 2 is happening. In case we haven't announced it yet. Well, we have announced it. We, we're not shy about it. We're all talking about it in the chat. How we're hyped for Season 2. I'm sure the guys have talked about it in the other videos. We're definitely doing a Season 2. Stay tuned on my Twitter. Follow me on Twitter. And follow the IBA Twitter. Uh, which I also got to put down in the link below. The IBA Twitter is not active right now, but I definitely do want it. Want to get it more active. Move the little mic there. Um, right now I'm the only one running the IBA Twitter, and that's one of the reasons why it's not as active. Um, we had the idea that maybe multiple of us should actually run the Twitter, and that's what we're going to move to. I've been ra ranting now for like two minutes about nothing. Let's get into this, and I'll continue to talk about more. But like I said, if you haven't watched the rest of the series, definitely go and check it out. First things first, I gotta switch this down to mid, uh, down to medium, and I gotta change this frame. The frame, I'm I'm not a fan of that frame. Where's my frame? I like that one. I also like the steel pipes. Let's go with the steel pipes. Let's go with steel pipes. Why did I switch the text speed to medium? Because West explained to me last time. He's like, so somebody put the text speed on slow. I didn't understand why. Uh, and it was just too slow for me. So I put it on fast. Thinking fast text, right? Well, I guess, I don't know if it was me. I might have forgotten to tell the IBA that I put on in the randomizer fastest text possible. Fastest text speed. So we wouldn't have to do that. And when you put fast with fastest text speed, it skips all the dialogue. So definitely go check West's video because he tries to, like, question what they would say because he doesn't understand why all the dialogue's being skipped. But either way, let's check out a summary of our team. West told me about this. He did a little bit of shiny hunting. There was an error with the legendary. It was supposed to be randomized for another legendary, but it wasn't. I guess I messed up on the randomization. But we got Bugsy the Heracross. Shiny. With a dr liquid ooze ability, holding the amulet coin with arrow blast, takedown, reversal, and mega horn. You guys might know the team. I'm doing a team recap because I don't know what it is. We have another Bugsy. Interesting. The Vibrava, Vibrava, with the natural cure ability, holding a shell bell with sand tomb, dragon breath, faint attack, and crunch. Then we got Fat Bat the Crow Bat with the huge power ability, poison barb with bite, wing attack, confuse ray. Blah, and fly then we got frieza the cute charming you two with the leftovers ability with ice punch surf swift and hydro pump nice and then we got proton the magneton flash fire ability holding the magnet with spark hydro pump bone meringue and thunder wave apparently we got some powerful tms was hydro pump like hydro pump must have been a tm at the um move tutor uh not move tutor at the Mega Mart. I'm not going to use some too much speed up right now. Actually, I'm going to speed up to the Pokemon Center. Let's check out what we got hidden in the box because we only have a team of five right now, and we're going into we're going into the Elite Four in this thing. So I'm why is the XP share on Seeking in the box? Take party. Actually, I could just do bag. What other items are in here? Move Pokemon. It's gonna move Pokemon. Let's do that. Hornia Sea King, Iglypuff, Hoots the Noctel. Ooh, a Premier Ball. Okay, let's grab some items. Let's grab the items. Oh, I'm messing up. In case you don't know who I am, like you don't watch me, I do not read dialogue. Um, whatsoever. Oh my god. And I mess up all the time. 
Ooh, there's a Primeape in here. We got a Snorlax. Parasect. There's some power in here. Ooh, I gotta see if we have a Moonstone. Nidoran could be nice. Ah. I don't know. Whiskash. We got some decent mons in here. I'd be definitely down for that Pinsir. However. So we had a Togetic. We had a Swampert. I heard about this thing. It's gone. Oh my god. At least some powerful mons. Alright. Well, let me pick up Sea King here. Because just in case we need to put any HMs on anyone. Because I think HMs are fully compatible with anyone. Because that's what we did. But yeah. Definitely going to use some speed up here. Because we're just heading to Victory Road. No big deal there. We're going to head to Victory Road. Um, speaking of HMs. Actually, you know what? Let's fly. Let's fly to Maz Deep. Oh, I also need a heal before I go anywhere. Um, I'm completely blanking on what I was about to say. Oh, did they check out the move tutors down here? I can't do this anymore. It's utterly hopeless. I'm a fighting type. Uh, teach your Pokemon Snatch. No. Does he teach something too? No. Um, but yeah, this is the finale of the IBA. Um, I also have moments where... So I'm, I have two different kinds of things. I call myself... I call my conversations ADHD conversations. I do not have ADHD. Um, not to say that it would be bad if I did. That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying I don't have ADHD. So... I call them ADHD conversations, though, is because I switch from topic to topic nonstop. Let's swap something, like, right there. Completely thought about something, and I'm like, hmm, let's change something here. Let's put Bugsy up in front, start training it up, because we're going to need to do some training, and let's give him this to power up his Dark-type moves. It almost gives him, like, Dark-type stuff. Ooh, a Squirtle here. One crunch and knock it out, yeah. Maybe I'll just fast forward through battles, but while we're going like this, nice calm. But for battles right now, not in the Elite Four. In the Elite Four, I want to use zero speed up. So there you go. Right then and there, that was what I mean by ADHD conversations. I was talking about one thing. I was literally talking about ADHD conversations. Lost my train of thought. It's either ADHD or ADD. Probably ADD conversations. Uh, that would be a better name for it. Uh, lost my train of thought. Went on to something else. And then forgot what I was talking about before. I completely just skipped it, essentially. Crunch. Bang. So that's what I mean by ADD conversations. That's one of the type of conversations that I'll have. The other type of conversation I'll have is I'll be talking and then, like, completely forget that I was talking and just be mute. And not realize I'm mute. Now, that wouldn't be that great for commentary now, would it? So I'm going to try to stay on the ball and try to keep my ADD conversations um, and not my, like... ADD conversation to mute. My mute conversations. That's what I'm going to try to do. Will it work? Not sure. Ooh. Okay, Frieza, get out here. Show this man what we can... I said Frieza. Lefties! Oh, we don't have a psychic type move. I hope we get psychic before we go into the gym. Oh, uh, not the gym. The... Oh... Okay, I thought I was going to level up a lot more than that. Got a little worried. Um, ooh, we get an encounter here. I don't... if the, That Squirtle, if we were able to catch it, I didn't know. I don't know where people got encounters. The past couple recordings, nobody sent me a list of what we're able to catch and what we're not able to catch. Octillery is going to be our encounter. I don't really see myself using that. Intimidate. Not a bad ability. But we have so many mods that have water-type moves on the squad right now that I don't know if it's worth to catch yeah it's not worth catching this thing i'm just gonna kill it uh we have a lot of mons in the box that i could use if needed nobody knows waterfall okay uh <laughs> waterfall luckily we have it could you imagine if i came all the way here we didn't even get it yet like somebody forgot to pick it up that would suck 
Yeah, ADHD conversations. <laughs> um, we're just going to get on with the thing. So what I want to do right now is um, I want to go and get my encounter inside this tunnel. Inside the cave. Once I do that, I'm going to cut the recording and I am going to grind. There's not going to be a montage. Uh, I don't think anybody wants to sit, sit and watch a montage in the middle of a finale. So I'm going to do a montage. I'm going to search up the levels for the uh, thing. Um, and I'm going to get myself to a decent level. I'm thinking at least 50, if not like 55. I could call dupes. Let me hit it once. Wow. Um, yeah. Uh, that I I just set this thing up so good for a catch. I'm I, I need to catch it. I know we have a lot of water type moves, but it's a friggin' swamper. It will be a swampert at least. Um. I want this thing. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. The Swampert would just be too good to pass up on. And I think that's our last encounter. I forgot to nickname it. I am going to nickname it during the grinding. Uh, I'm also going to check out the box again. See what the best final team is. But yeah, like I said, I'm going to cut. I'm probably going to cut here. Do some grinding because we have a Wally fight. And our team is so underleveled for that Wally fight. That Wally's got like complete team of level 50s if I'm not mistaken. Um, but I'm going to train up for what I want to be at before the Elite Four. Um, and go from there. So, I'm going to see you guys in like two seconds. I'll be back. And yeah, stay salty till I'm back. Alright, and we are back. How are y'all doing now? I just did a bit of grinding and changed up the team a little. Well, actually, I just added somebody onto the team. Let's check it out with a little bit of a team recap. First up, we got the person I just added. Zelda the Primeape with the cute charm ability. No item just yet with cross chop, ice punch, acid, and a last move that has to be determined. I guess people, if you put dive and fly on him, I guess they didn't feel like going back to grab an HM slave. So they just slapped it on this Primeape here. Picked them up, deleted those two. Yeah, why did I add this guy instead of the Mudkip? So I decided to level up the Mudkip. Mudkip was already level 38, right? 38, 37, something like that. Leveled it up once. Accidentally clicked B. Joy. Leveled up a second time. Got Marsh Tom. Beautiful. Leveled it up again. Level 40. Trained it up to level 48. It's a Swampert, right? Cute Charm ability, too. Not that great. Um... But this guy has cute charm too, right? So, what does it matter? Nothing. Let's keep it. 48. Checked out its move pool afterwards. Hadn't learned anything. I'm like, what the hell? What's it got? It only learned protect. And I was looking at the move pool and it never fully dawned on me. I'd like, protect? Takedown? Mud sport? And foresight. Took off foresight. Added, um, what I add? Added Surf. Tried to teach a Bumerang. Doesn't learn Bumerang. Tried to teach it other TMs. Doesn't learn any good TMs. Yeah. No. It gets Earthquake in like a level. I missed out on Muddy Water. Because I accidentally pressed B. Um, and uh, yeah. Oh my god. I have like water in my ear or something. I took a shower. Um, in between too. Um, no, I took a shower just before. Sorry. Not in between. I took a shower just before. And, uh, so yeah, Swampert just wasn't that great. So, I brought Primeape on instead. Next up, we got Heracross. He's the exact same. Then we got Proton, exact same. Fat Bat has Poison Fang now instead of Confuse Ray. I'm really hoping that doesn't bite me in the ass in the Elite Four. Now we got this guy. Same move pool? Yep, yeah, same move pool. Hadn't learned Earthquake yet. I forget. I think it learns it at level 50. So, to learn it in the Elite Four, hopefully. Mewtwo, Ice Punch, Surf, Swift, Hydro Pump, same thing. I could have taught it Future Sight, 
but I didn't really want to get Surf because it's 100% accurate, and I didn't want to get rid of Swift because Swift is guaranteed hit in case they double team or raise their invasiveness, unless they're ghost type. So, yeah, once we learn Psychic, something's definitely going to go, but I don't even think we learn Psychic till like level 70. Why'd I level up to 48? 48 is the second highest level of the first Elite Four member, and I did not want to get too over leveled. Yes, we are going to be 10 levels under leveled for the champion, but you know what? It is what it is. First things first. Let's max repel. Okay. So now here's the thing. Full disclosure. I think I know where to go. Not 100% sure though. So we're going to find out and see. Now we got the Wally battle. Let's kill this guy. Cross drop. I missed already. I wanted to teach him. I wanted to teach him. Um, high critical hit. It has a high critical hit. What is it? It's not cross drop. It's 100% accurate. 100% accurate. 50 damage, I think. High critical hit ratio, though. I was hoping we had a black belt to give to this guy to boost his fighting type moves, but we didn't. So I might give him the silk scarf and teach him strength after this. But for now, we're going to roll like this. I swapped into the wrong mod. I wanted to swap into... Uh, I wanted to swap into Flygon, but I messed up. So, but either way, we're level 49. Some people are 49. This guy is 49, which is the same level as his highest level. I completely wasn't paying attention to his level. I was, like, grinding on, like, super speed. And I wasn't paying attention to his level. And, like, I got him almost to 50. But that's okay, like, it's level 50. It's not that big of a deal. We're not over... We're under leveled for this Elite Four. Like I said, he's the highest level of the first Elite Four member. There's four Elite Four members plus champion to beat. So, and we're still 10 levels lower right now for the um for the champion and we're not going to get to par before the champion it's not going to happen waste another full restore i think you have two nope you don't okay i am recording right yeah all right beauty gotta double check that because in case you don't in case you're not from my channel i do a soul link with w3s7 another member of the um iba actually this thing's right there but nope down there down well, all the way down there. Down there, I mean. Um, on the bottom... Left? Underneath the gameplay. Underneath the gameplay, at the corner, it says West Channel name there, because he had episode 7. Um, but yeah. One thing I am a little upset about with the team is that I don't have a fire type, and I couldn't even teach anybody a fire type move. So that kind of sucked. But it is what it is can't really do anything about it and we're just gonna go from there i am happy that we did get fat bat a poison type move because he was holding a poison barb but without an actual poison type move so now that poison barb's actually coming into good use when we actually use his move hello swine see this is where a fire type could come into play one reason i took primate on the squad was because we didn't have a fighting type but think about it now heracross is fighting and heracross level 70 so, I don't know how often Primate is going to get used in the actual Elite Four. But I don't want to rely on Heracross too much because he is overleveled for the Elite Four. So, he's going to be like a, oh shit, we're losing Heracross. But at the same time, a strong flying type is going to kill us. But, ah, we won't worry about that. Actually, any flying type might kill us. Blossom. Let's stay in and go for the Ice Punch. That's hilarious. He had Blossom Gloom. Imagine if he gets Vile Plume. We won't know. I think this is our last battle against him. Unless we battle him at the end of the thing too. But I think that's only an Oras. I'm not sponsored by G Fuel, obviously, though. Obviously not. I'm one of the smallest channels on the IBA, I think. I'm only at about 58 subscribers. 59, maybe? And I think that makes me the smallest channel. Um, the smallest channel part of the IBA, but I'm also the commissioner. So, like, that's how I got in. Um, and in case you don't know, let's talk about IBA for a second. IBA Season 1. Great start. We didn't do tiers. Um, I'm not used to drafting without tiers. So, um, it's not the reason I sucked this season. In case you didn't know, I went 0-8. I went 0-8, but come on. Week 8 versus the guy that's 8-0. Oh. 
it came down to a crit. Yeah, I know there's people that are going to be like, yeah, but HP, you guys restarted. Could have been different. Yeah, but it kind of evened out the HP. I had a little more. He had a little more. I missed a high jump kick. La la la. Uh, I didn't miss a high jump kick. He had a little more. Two high jump kicks would have killed that Rotom Wash. There's a lot of things you could have said. And even with the HP I had beforehand, all I would have had to do is protect first. And it would have came out to the same results. If I had protected first turn in this one, I might have had a, I would have had a better chance of surviving it and winning. Because if I think I protected, I would have had enough HP that even the crit wouldn't have killed me. But it is what it is. I'm not salty about it. Like, well, I'm salty about it. I'm not mad about it. <laughs> like, I'm salty that a crit won it. But, like, it's Pokemon. That's what happens. I'm salty about Pokemon. I'm not salty about JV. I'm salty about Pokemon. <laughs> I am so salty. I'm like, he got a crit. <laughs> but it is what it is. That's Pokemon. There's nothing you could do. I should have healed. Uh, let's go for a nice bunch. Oh, of course you're going to protect. Speaking of protect. Um, I just want to... We're going to fast forward through this thing. Because I want to get through this. I want to get to the Elite Four. It's finale. Come on. Come on. I got to stop doing rapid movements. My camera is not at a quality to support rapid movements. I also want to train up. Let's put the guys in front that need the levels to get new moves. Yeah, I don't want to deal with this. Mm. You know what? He's not... I don't think he's going to learn a move. If he learns a move and this bites me in the butt, so be it. Nobody picked up Flash. Flash is an HM. Oh, uh, we're going to need strength either way. I just remembered. We're going to need strength. Earn strength. Because we come here. Yeah. All right. Yeah. It's a finale. We're all here to see what's going to happen. Are we going to win this? And you know what? We're going to. I backtracked. My bad. No, please don't tell me I need Rock Smash 2. <sighs> Rock smash. I guess you're back to being an HM slave. Either way, I taught acid on him just because it was one of the only things he learned. I didn't mean to do that. Huh. Huh. Can I go down here and just rock smash here and make up for it? I told you guys, I think I know where to go. Not 100% sure, though. Oh, who are we fighting? Yeah, I'm not 100% sure where I'm going, but I think I know where I'm going. But at the same time, I don't know where I'm going. I'm not going to lie to you. I have no clue where I am right now. Oh, yeah. Wait. He's a dragon type. I'm an idiot. You to fly. Dragon breath should kill. Oh, nope. Don't infatuate me. Don't do this to me. I do not want to love you. I am a free-spirited individual. Is this exactly where it was? No. Okay. Okay. I guess I'm supposed to go down then? Let's go. Why not? Oh, I need waterfall, don't I? I might need waterfall. Um... Did anybody know that he had Miracoat? I didn't know he had Miracoat. I really hope I don't get lost in this place. Yeah, Miracoat that. Huh? 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 Uh, Frieza. Frieza. Oh, 
That might kill too. Yep. Ooh, hair cross. Don't take down me. Megahorn would have done more anyways. If you even have it at that level. Wait. Did our repel wear out? So it come this way. But it's this way, right? Yeah. <sighs> Who am I teaching waterfall to? Wait, do I have another ice punch? I have karate chop though. Karate chop's a hundred and cross chop keeps missing. You know what? I'm just gonna do that. I'm sorry, my guy. Oh no, not dive. Ooh. I'm sorry, my guy, but with hair cross on the squad. I'm sorry! If I had any doubt that this was the wrong way, I wouldn't do it to you. What the hell am I? I thought it was a wall here. My bad. Yes, I'm supposed to go down here. I'm gonna come here. Go up here. Oh. I'm not going to lie, I thought it was up and out. I thought it was up and out. Alright, alrighty then. Don't detect me. Okay, who just... We're going to have an issue. I think your name was Veronica or something. We're going to have an issue if you keep detecting me, okay? I am not a fan of it. Oh yeah, but back to Bo but Season 1 of IBA. I completely forgot we were talking about that. See, I think I went mute commentary for a bit. Didn't even realize. Um, season 1 of IBA was not the greatest, obviously. Oh, her name was Veronica. I was right. Like, wasn't the greatest for your boy. Um, season 2, though. Mm, you ain't ready for Season 2. You are not ready for Season 2. I um, We have it drafted, obviously. We're still looking for people. We want to expand. I want to go up to at least 10, if not 12. Um, more than 12, I'm a little scared about. Um, just because I've been in big draft leagues before, not for YouTube, but I've been in them before, and when you have too many people, it can get, um, it can get hard to get everybody to stick around, get everybody's games done, and be on top of everything dock wise and stuff then again i wasn't even the one keeping up to date on the dock this uh this season iba i mean my boy uh titan universe he crushed it on the dock updating it all the time for me am i going the right way here is this the right way i don't know where i am i don't remember emerald being this hard the thing I'm glad I didn't do this for my sleepwalk now. Victory Road is always my downfall. I don't know where to go on Victory Roads, and I never refresh myself. That's the reason I lost my last sleepwalk, was because I'm tired, I'm done with this Victory Road thing, I quit. Actually, my first ever sleepwalk. Wasn't that big, but still, it was fun. I guess I do not get Earthquake at level 60. Wonder Guarding Diglett. I... Stop earthquaking, kid. And stop rubbing in my face that you have earthquake and I don't. How does Diglett get earthquake first? Oh, 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 oh! What's going on here? That's not the right way. Yeah, I thought it was literally up and out. Ah! 
Yeah, but season one wasn't the greatest. We're looking to expand for season two. Um. Yeah, I mean, I don't think I did. I mean, I didn't do good at all. I think season two is going to be very different. I think I will be able to crush season two of IBA. Um, season two of IBA, we're also going to be implementing tiers, so nobody's going to be having broken teams and stuff. Um, the way I drafted my team, I drafted it with, like, I went with a mentality of I want a couple mods that I'm used to um and a couple mods that I've never used before Cinderace oh my god like Cinderace was just like too good to not grab so that one and I love Cinderace I think I played pretty well with them um I relied too much on court change and I didn't breed him enough and I just didn't get him battle ready um ever throughout the entire season um and then what Rotom Heat. Rotom Heat, another good Mon. That was my... I've used somebody like him before. I never used him exactly, but I used... I had used Rotom Mo, and I've used Rotom Wash before. So I was like, bet. Um, and I didn't use Rotom Heat that much, and that's one of the reasons why I got rid of him. Um... Since, yeah, since you already don't know, since you won't know until week one of playoffs, I'm going to mention it now. He's not even going to be on my team week one of playoffs. Maybe, maybe not. Actually, I say that, but I'm like, I haven't even looked at my team. I haven't looked at my team. I haven't even looked at West's team to know if I should be bringing him because I don't even remember West's team off the top of my head. Um, I haven't even started thinking about my team, so I don't know why I said that. But in case I don't bring him... um. I picked up Frost Moth for Rotom Heat. Um, dropped Rotom Heat, picked up Frost Moth. And now since the season's over, we cannot make any more changes. We had until the end of the season to make any changes we want with three. But only you only had three free agent slots. And we are out of the cave after 20 minutes. It probably should not have taken 20 minutes. Now let's sell items and buy a shit ton of heal healing items. We're gonna sell all of our Pokeballs, Premier Ball, any TM that we don't think we're gonna use. Okay, let's go to the top so you can set up Curse, Cosmic Power, Toxic, Sunny Day. Yeah, we're gonna keep the rest. Sell. So, Exact oh, I probably should have kept the X accuracy just in case. You can sell the XP share now. We're not going to be using it. A hold item that restores HP upon striking the foe. Get rid of Shell Bell. Get rid of both of them. Mystic Water, we're going to keep around in case. Rabies is Ooh. We're going to use that. That, gone, that, gone, that. Gone. 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 Keep. Prevent stats reduction when used in battle. Keep. Keep. Uh, Dragon Fang. Keep. Metal Coat. Do we have anyone? Yes. I'll keep it for now. Oh, I could give that to power up his Ice Punches. Now that I think about it. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. I'm just going to buy a bunch of full heals. All right. Now let's buy full restores. Let's buy 15 full restores. 18 full heals. Because why not? If we can, we might as well, right? Now, before we do anything, let's fly. Let's clear off Zelda's moveset so we can actually use him better. Um, Zelda, get rid of Waterfall. And we're going to get rid of Rock Smash too, just in case he learns something. 
Let's teach him. Karate chop. I think I mentioned earlier in the episode that he couldn't learn that, eh? Teach him takedown? Okay. Bone Marine? Okay. We'll go with that. We'll go with that. Gift to Zelda. And now we're good. We are good to take on the Pokemon League. All right, I hope you guys are ready to take on the final challenge in this tag lock. If you guys think we're going to win, let me know down below in the comments section if you think we are going to win this challenge. But yes, I shall see you all inside. I'm not making a cut, so I don't know why I said it like that. We're hopping right in. I have an hour to finish this. I've got time. I've got time. Who do we want to lead with? Do we want to lead with Bugsy? Let's call it Bugsy 2.0. Or Bugsy. This is Bugsy and the other one's Safety Bugsy. Let's lead with... Sure, let's lead with Bugsy. I'm not even going to read your dialogue, dude. It's going to be like, yo, I'm a dark type. I'm not going to have dark type. That's a burp. I'm not going to have dark type Pokemon, though. But you know what? Let's battle. There you go. I'll do what Wes did. I'll try to come up with everything that they said. And I really should have put somebody else in front. Uh, yeah, intimidate me all you want. I'm going to try not to use any speed up during this final fight. Because it's the Elite Four. It's the whole point of the game. This is the final run. We don't want to speed up through this. Spark. Let's go. Oh, co. Oh, co. Yeah. I'm only going to speed up if there's like a stall. If like we get up against someone and they're stalling big time, that's when I'll speed up. Flygon. Beauty. 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 Frieza. We're going to ice punch with Frieza. Where did we get Ice Punch from? Because we have we got two of them. So did we just pick them up and we luckily got two or what? Or does Primeape learn Ice Punch? I love what I don't think so. And Flygon is bygone. Oh yeah, let's keep it going. Muck. Muck, muck, muck. What do you got for me? Why are you sending in a poison type against my psychic type? What do you know? I don't have any psychic moves. Guess what? I still have surf and that's gonna do some damage. D -d 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 damage. Let's go. Oh my god, that did not do damage. Ah, so this is why you sent Muck in. This is okay. I'm okay with that. Habuya. How much Sledge Bomb doing me? Ah! I'm not a fan of that. Yeah. You know what, Proton, get in here. Oh, wait. He probably has a ground type. Move. I don't. Does he have a ground type move? He probably has Mudshot. He probably has Mudshot. He probably has Mudshot. He won't have anything for Crobat, though, but does Crobat have anything to him? Could you not? Um, I mean, we got stuff. We got stuff. Don't miss wing attack. Oh, yeah. Okay, you're eating that. You're eating that. You're eating that. Let's go. Is acid armor defense or special defense? It is defense. Okay. Let's go for a bite then. Bite special. Mmm. Didn't want to see that. Didn't want to see that. Bite special. You got this, fat bat. Let's go. Is bite not special? It's emerald. The physical special split is not in this game yet. Bite's special. 
The special is all evolutions plus dragon. Hmm. <laughs> Let's bring you in here. You can eat something. Sand tomb for residual damage. It might have been a good idea to keep that extra accuracy. Okay, so this is the type of... I think it got a crit. It got a crit. This is the type of thing that I was talking about that if we get stalled, I'm going to... Speed up. Sent him. Sweet. He's lowering my defenses, though. We have an X... We have X defend. We have X speed. Proton. Okay. I don't think he has ground type. I think we're good. We're good. Ooh. I took a risk there. I took a risk there. I don't know if that caught my back cracking. I was tense there. Carvana. Show me what you got, Carvana. Show me what you got. Mm. You don't want a taste of this proton. We got protons. We got neutrons. And guess what? Um, you're a dead Tron. I don't know. That wasn't good. I'm sorry. I make stupid jokes sometimes. Jokes that don't make sense. Jokes you don't really want to hear. But guess what? Unfortunately, you're going to have to hear them because you're watching the finale. Uh, I don't know whose idea it was to give him, give me the finale. Apparently, mostly IBA. Apparently, mostly IBA. By the way, if you didn't know, we took a vote on who gets each episode. Well, we took a vote on who gets episode one, who gets up, who gets the final episode. It wasn't just me going, you're getting this, you're getting this, you're getting this. It was a vote for those two. Uh, and I asked, like, what episode do you guys want? Some of the people said, I really want that. I want this episode, but if you can't give it to me, okay. If they said they wanted that episode, I was like, I bet you get that episode. However, like, episode one and episode eight were votes. Um, and the person that got episode two and episode seven were the ones that came in second place for those votes. So, like, Wes came in second place to get the finale, I think. And JV came in second place to get episode one. So, that's how it happened. Just so you know, so it wasn't, like, a me being a Democrat. Like, even in the IBA, like, anybody will vouch for this. Like, I'm not, like, a Democrat in the IBA. I'm just like, hey, guys. What's up? Like, what are we do? Like, what are we doing about Dynamax Cat? captains and stuff i was like personally i'm not a big fan i'm really happy we actually did them because they were a lot of fun at first i didn't want to do them but i was like listen i'm not a big fan of them but if you guys are interested in it i'm down so we took a vote on that like i was like one person that voted no everybody else was like yes i'm down uh but we are gonna be doing stuff a little bit different for season two for sure season two with the drafting and the tiers i'm probably gonna make it where you draft a Gigantamax captain. Where in this, it was... Um, we did free tiers, in case you didn't know. There was no tiered system. It was draft whoever, whenever... I don't care. That's what it was. Because tiers weren't out for other leagues. And none of us really knew how to make our own tiers. Like, and not be biased with it. So... That's what we did. And then after... Pretty much, I did it like Z-Captains were back in Usum. After that, you choose a Z-Captain. Sorry. You choose a Gigantamax Captain or a Dynamax Captain. Like me, I chose Sylveon, where JV chose Gigantamax Gengar and stuff. Where in next season, we're probably going to be drafting an actual G-Max Captain. There might even be tiers for G-Max Captains, where some of them might get you free points. I'm Phoebe. I did my training on Mount Pier. I'm a ghost type Elite Four that's not gonna have any ghost type. But yeah, um Season two, definitely gonna have some G Max captains. Might even do some tiers for that. We're definitely gonna be doing tiers in uh IBA season two. Probably not three OU, three UU. It's probably gonna be like tier one, tier two, two tier threes, tier four, tier five four free picks plus a G max pick um and yeah a couple of the guys aren't 
quite a few of the guys actually in the league aren't familiar with tears um they've this for a lot of the guys in the league this was their first taste of a um draft league which was one of the reasons why i reached out to them because i'm like they're not doing draft league comp content like west he wasn't doing draft league content but he was doing um bgc content so i was like ooh, let me reach out to him and blah 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 and this that and all sorts of things but um yeah I, I i say but yeah a lot and i don't know what to say i just go hmm but yeah oh sea king golden sea king wow interesting why am i staying in games water types that might have ice beam he doesn't have ice beam why am i even staying in um let's go into proton go into proton let's knock this thing out but season two i'm just so pumped for season two i can't wait um the iba is like the last big thing that we're all doing besides playoffs at the end of playoffs we're all gonna come together have a little live stream there's gonna be a little live stream i'll announce that now we're gonna do a little live stream and talk in the live stream what we liked about season one and just do do like a season one review at first it's gonna be like a season one review we're gonna talk about what we liked what we didn't like what were some intense battles uh i think titan even created a list of questions to like discuss in the live stream and then we're gonna also talk about what we'd like to see change for season two. Oh yeah you don't have a fighting type move uh what we'd like to see change for season two now we've all discussed and we've all agreed that we want tiers in season two um to make it more like a draft league right now this wasn't really a, like this was a draft league but it was such a like on it was such a like a different draft league like nobody's ever done something like that before that i know of and the reason i did that was because i didn't want to wait for tiers because i wanted to be one of the first draft leagues so we kept pushing it off a little the weeks and yeah and then we ended up not being one of the first draft leagues, which kind of sucked. But, um, still really fun. And uh, we might not be one of the first draft leagues, but I'd say one of the, we are one of the, like, closest-knit group of draft league guys. We're in the Discord all the time talking. There's nobody that's not in the Discord talking. All of us talk to each other. All of us reel on each other, like, me right now being like, yo, I'm the underdog. I'm coming back. I'm winning this. And, like, I said that. Then JV's like, yo, Salty, I'm actually kind of scared for you from la last game. And I'm like, good. It's all mind games from here. I'm coming in. I'm winning this. We're all railing on each other. Like, we took eight YouTubers. And that was one of the things. I just wanted Earthquake. I gotta stop talking and pay attention sometimes. That's sad. I'm sad by that. Um, let's bring this guy out. Your psychics aren't gonna do anything to me. Um, surf. But yeah, one thing I... One thing I wanted to do when I made the IBA, it wasn't just about a draft league. I wanted to start a group of content creators up. A group of content creators to get to know so we can bounce ideas off each other. That's one thing that we do a lot too is we talk about content. And I don't know. It's just, it's really nice. We've gotten really close in the IBA over the course of these past couple months. Really close. Like we've, it's march we've known each other since what january is when we really started to talk maybe december is when i started it up and started a twitter group but a twitter group chat but that was just to make sure everybody's on board there wasn't much talking going on in the twitter group until we made the discord got in a crit there i don't think the crit mattered but that is awesome we also just lost one member and it's only the second gym leader that scares me um but yeah, I just wanted, the IBA wasn't just about creating a draft league. It was also about creating a group of guys to talk, a community, start our own little community of guys to, to like help each other out and not just for like growing and stuff, like help us make our content better by talking with somebody else 
and just I'm gonna waste all the super potions here because they're kind of useless and yeah I probably should have bought more than just 20 full heals but yeah so and that's what IBA has really done well my name is Glacial the Elite Four. I traveled from from afar to the Hoenn so that I am home to up my ice skills. I'm not gonna have any ice type mods, but let's get real chill. That was real bad. Um, yeah, and that's one thing with the IBA. I just love about the IBA. The IBA, it was a draft league, but I also really wanted a group of other content creators that all of us can talk with each other and even find collab partners. So before the IBA started, that was one thing that I really wanted was finding a collab partner. I really wanted to start a soul link, which is where me and West grew. Me and West were on each other's Twitter, kind of talking much. Oh yeah, he's in the lead now because Flycon's dead. Yeah, before the IBA started, me and West were just kind of commenting on each other's posts on Twitter. We weren't really talking that much. And then we started getting into the IBA. Uh, I was joining his live streams, and I was like, right now I'm looking for, like, I was just talking about, like, what I want to do with my content. Me and him were just talking about content, what we want to do, and I was like, I'm really down to start a collab with somebody soon. I don't know who yet, though, and he's like, what are you looking to do? And I told him, and he's like, I'd be down for a Soul Link, and I'm like, I'm down. He's like, I'm down. I'm like, let's get some art made, and we got some art made, and then we brought the Soul Link to life, and if you haven't, if you haven't watched the Soul Link, definitely go watch the Soul Link. Me and his soul link, we we did, we did Volt White to, and Blaze Black to. That did not go well. Gave up on that. Started up Diamond and Pearl. Now I got Diamond and Pearl. Bit of a rocky start, too. But now we're breezing. We're flying. Definitely check it out. We're not flying too high, but we're flying. We're soaring. We're soaring. Flying. I cannot sing for the life of me. Yeah, I'm not a very good singer. I don't I don't got the vocals. I don't got the vocals. I probably just killed all your ears and I am sorry. Oh my god, can you be bulky proton? Seeing how weak these guys are is really scaring me for final for the final battle cuz this is against people that are the same level Jinx. Do you really have anything for Jinx? Nope. Nope. Shift. Bugsy, come in! Last hope! We're worried now. But, um... Yeah, IBA was just so great, and... This is coming to the end of season one. And I was like, we wanted to take a one-week break. Like, we wanted one weekend off before playoffs to kind of build up the suspense for playoffs. Because, guys, you aren't ready for playoffs. Not the IBA guys, but the viewers. You're not ready for playoffs. Playoffs are going to be so packed. Everybody is bringing their A game. The trash talk has already started in Discord, like I was talking about before. Everybody's bringing their A game for playoffs. This is our last chance to show. And all eight coaches made it to playoffs. The reason we did this is because we're only eight guys. And we're like, it's season one. Let's make it simple. Everybody makes it to playoffs. Season two, that's not how it's going to be. If we are t 10 or 12, only eight or 10 are going to make it to playoffs. With uh, rounds one, round one getting a uh, like top place getting a buy. Or maybe nine, if we're 12, nine people to make it to playoffs. Person one gets a buy or something like that. But yeah, it's playoffs is going to be intense. You're not going to want to miss it. Uh, you're for sure not going to want to miss playoffs because it's just going to be so sick. And yeah, but since since we we're taking a one week break from this, I'm like, yo, I don't think we should stop the IBA content. I think stopping the I IBA content would be a mistake. Let's hype up playoffs. So I'm like. How about a tag lock? And they were all down, and I definitely want to continue something similar in Season 2. If we're more than 8, it might be hard to do a tag lock. 
but I definitely want to do something similar for IBA Season 2. Date to be revealed. But if you're interested, let me say it now. If you're interested in the IBA Season 2, follow me on Twitter. I'll follow you back and hit me up. You do have to be a content creator, though, obviously. Um, we're all content creators. This is a YouTube league. Um, you have to be a content creator. But if you aren't interested, hit me up on Twitter. DM me. Slide into my DMs. Let me know now that you're interested so I can keep you in mind for when we find. Because, like, if we have a lot of interest, then I might go bigger than 12. It might happen. IBA might be huge. Who knows? We might even have two separate conferences. Like, an 8 and an 8. We all draft together, but it's 8 and 8. You versus this 8, and then they all go up against each other. And we're going to, like, mix and match the conferences for playoffs. But, um... Yeah, it's going to be interesting. So, definitely... Definitely be on the lookout for IBA news, and definitely be following me and the IBA... Because I, I sometimes just sit, say it on my own Twitter rather than the IBA's Twitter. I'm really not that great at running two Twitter accounts right now. So that's why I say follow both. Um, but if you're going to DM something for interest for the IBA, follow me personally. Because the IBA account right now is mostly following only the people in the IBA. So if you're going to be, if you have interest in being a part of the IBA, Definitely follow me and let me know. Unless you already know somebody that's a part of the IBA, definitely hit, you can hit them up too, and they'll hit me up. It's a lot easier though, just to not cause any trouble. Directly hit me up. Um, if I don't follow you back, tweet at me. Tag slightly salted, uh, slightly salty. Sorry. Um, follow me back. Let's talk about IBA. Or something like that. And if, in case you don't want your viewers to know that you're interested in the IBA, you want it to be a surprise. Because that's another thing that I'm going to do. Is I put a teaser out for the IBA. I'm going to be putting a teaser out for IBA Season 2 as well. Um, that's definitely going to be a thing. I'm going to have another teaser announcing IBA Season 2. All the coaches. Um, I also want to have a breakdown video of IBA Season 2 like I did for IBA Season 1. A breakdown who's in the league, what their name is, what the IBA Season 2 is going to be doing, what's banned, what's allowed, stuff like that. A more structured one, I guess, a more professional one. Because uh, the other one was, like, really not the greatest. I want to get better with the content, the value that I'm bringing to the channel. I've only killed one of them. Wow. This is hilarious. She's... What did I just kill? I forget what I just killed. But she actually has an ice type. She has a spiel. Actually, that was last. Who am I fighting now? Oh, I'm fighting Drake. <sighs> they say good. Let's go to Bugsy because he cannot hit Bugsy with a sheer cold. He got a sheer cold on me. I didn't even know sheer... Uh, Sfeel had sheer cold at this level. This ain't looking good for your boy. Bugsy's gonna have to come in clutch. Bugsy, you're gonna have to come in clutch, buddy. Seedra. I don't think I have anything else for him. Nope. Nope. You're staying in. We gotta focus on the game. We gotta focus on this. Takedown. How much are you doing? Beauty. Luckily, any mon that I'm afraid is gonna have a one-hit KO move, you're coming in, buddy. Because, um... Steel landed it after one hit. I think. I'm pretty sure. It didn't try to use it the first time, did it? Unless I missed that. Unless I wasn't paying attention and I didn't see that it went for sheer cold the first time and if it did man that would be bad people are not going to be pleased with me who's got bone meringue you don't it's you right yeah shift 
hopefully these guys, these last four stay alive. But, um, it ain't looking good. It ain't looking the greatest right now. So, let's pray. I'm not religious, by the way. Not religious at all. I just... I'll make a triangle. Equilateral triangle, boys. Can people stop landing the low accurate moves? One. Two. Can we get three? We don't need three. Let's go. Why is everybody else's accuracy god tier, but I go for cross chop, but it takes two turns. That's why I got rid of it. I started the two-turn move. Come in and ice punch this thing. Ugh. We gotta shake it off, okay? We gotta shake this all off. We're going into the champion, okay? We made it to the champion, boy. Oh. One hit. Goes for a one hit. Goes for Fissure. Doesn't even have it, but goes for it. That would, that would be our luck. That would be our luck. He goes for Fissure. That would be our luck. And you know what? He would land it, too. He would land it. I don't know if he had another full restore left, but if he didn't use that berry, then he would have used that full restore if he had one left. So, I'm glad that berry came in clutch. Alright. Beauty. All right, we got to heal. We got to heal, and we got to get our head in the game, okay? We are going into the final trainer. We haven't... We're going into the finals, okay? This is not going to be easy. We're going to need to bring our A game, boys. I'm a little worried. Okay, why... Do you have, like, heartburn or something? I keep having, like, little mini burps. It's not coming up in the mic, I don't... I doubt. But it's like a... That kind of sounded like I was puking. It's not a puke. I don't feel like I need a puke. If I just yak on cam, it's dang. Maybe I'll black it out, but... I don't feel like I need a puke, and I don't feel sick. So I don't get it. It's just like a... Like... Like, you know when you burp, but, like, it's not a burp? I could have actually burped there. I can burp on command. But, I mean, it's just like a... You... you It gets... It has that roll. The roll. That's what I keep getting, and I don't know why. I feel like I got heartburn or something. But I haven't eaten in a while. But heartburn's chest pains, too. Like, you do that, but you get chest pains. I don't have any chest pains, so what's going on here? Fat Bat, you're gonna stay in front. You're gonna lead us to victory. Fat Bat's gonna do it all, okay? All right, Wallace, you water type master that has no water types. You going down. Down. The IBA is here, okay? We're going to we're teaming up here. We teamed up. The IBA. We were rivals. Now we're a team. Taking down Pokémon Emerald right here, right now. Final challenge. The champion. Let's go. It's a long episode. Let's go. All right, Fat Bat, you got this. Oh, Sandstream. What's going on with my hair there? Don't let the hype die down. Who cares about the hair? All righty, we're gonna go into the mighty Frieza to take you down. Let's go. Wow, I said to take you down, and he tried to use him take down. That is a shame. But you missed. Let's get out. Let's... I meant to say let's get out here. Don't let the hype down. Keep the hype up. Let's go. We're beating this. Let's go. Call yourself a champion? Well, guess what? You're getting dethroned. Okay? Mm -mm. Probably should have went for Hydro Pump. Oh, oh. Oh. Hydro Pump would have killed. But would it have landed? You can agility all you want. Actually, he's gonna he's gonna go for that full restore or that hyper potion. Oh shit. Messed up all my hair there. 
Oh, could you imagine if Sandstorm had killed? That would have been sick. Lefties coming in clutch. Yeah, you're going to heal. See, full restore. Bang. Land the Hydro Pump. He's got if you land it. Just land it. Land. L -l 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 land. Come on, Frieza. Woo! Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Let's get it. Huh. Fat Bat grew to 50. Great job, Fat Bat. Skitty. You gonna come out out here with a skitty? You know what? We're gonna stay in. We're gonna stay in. Could you imagine if, like, that was its only good mon, and now the rest are gonna be, like, skitties, caterpies, weedles, wormpole. But you know what? If it's not, it's if it's like that, it's like that. We deserve it, okay? After the terrible season we've had in IBA, I could use an easy match. <laughs> Surf, Surf's gonna kill, right? Surf should kill. Your six level's higher, but you're a Skitty. Skitty living. Oh, Skitty just killed itself. How didn't you kill yourself? I don't get that. Oh, it's dead. All right, what's coming out? What's coming out? Let's go. Come on. Come on. Bring it on. Bring it on. Core fish. Do I have anything that can handle it better than Frieza? Nope. We'll go for some Swifts. We'll go for some Swifts. You know what would have been really nice right here? Proton. A Proton became a Neutron and backed on out. Which ones are the outside the nucleus? It's Protons and... Is it protons and neutrons inside? Yeah, it's protons and neutrons out inside, inside, and electrons outside. So proton became an electron and left. Left as he was like, "I'm out of here." Swift again, swift, swift, swifty. Be swifty with it. I just slapped myself in the face. Um. Okay, can we not just die, Corfish? Die, Ryan. King Corfish out here trying to delay the IBA. IBA's victory. Yo, but honestly, this is IBA season one. Playoffs are coming. You're not ready for playoffs. But besides playoffs, we ain't even ready for season two. We're not even done season one. We're already talking about season two. We've been talking about season two since week three. Week three, we've been talking about season two. And you just aren't ready for it. You're not ready for it. A couple guys have already showed interest. We want more. We don't want interest. We want solid Darity, let's go. Actually, we want interest. We want interest. I'm joking. But, like, if there's a lot of people interested, I'm going to open it up to more. Like, I'm not going to stop at 10. I'm not going to stop at 12. I'll go to 16. Max 16. For, like, it's still... I still want to keep it close group. I still want to keep it as a close group of guys. Like, I'll, I still want to be able to meet all 16 of them and talk with all of them. And, like, our lobbies. If we're all 16, it's all 16 people, like, talking nonstop. Sorry, my back was at you there. <laughs> we're all talking in the chat, and, like, that lobby is gonna be popping. It's... He has another Rapidash, huh? Another one. I guess he wanted Sandstorm back out. Another Rapidash, huh? Well, guess what? We're gonna Hydro Pump him. We are gonna Hydro Pump you. To an oblivion. To an oblivion. Man, sometimes you just can't speak. Sometimes it'd be like that. Sometimes it'd be like that. And you know what? I'm not ashamed. Yeah, but season two, I'm pumped for already. Even though season one's not done, I'm already pumped for season two. And you know what? If you're not, then what the hell are you doing, man? Get hyped, get energized. Season 2 is not going to be far away from playoffs. It's going to be playoffs. Probably max. Max by June. If not earlier. We're aiming for earlier. But max by June. Season 2 is coming back. We don't want to take a long break. We're pumped. We're enjoying this. Let's bring on out Fat Bat to end this Hariyama. Is this the last one? Are we about to win? Nope, he has one more. 
bust out Rayquaza. Actually, Rayquaza wouldn't be that bad. We got Ice Punch. We got Ice Punch. Mm. We got Ice Punch on two Mons, too. Who would I not want to see? I would not want to see Kyogre. I would not want to see Kyogre right now. Bat Bat, please kill. Please hit. Oh, thank God. Oh, I did not want to lose Fat Bat there. I would have cried. I would have cried. All right, and I'm a champ. Fat Bat's going to end it off for us right here. Can. Oh, I just ripped that out of my own ear. I ripped that out of my ear. I was moving my foot. Ripped out my headphones out of my, my head. My earbuds out of my ear. Can we do it? I lost. I so my. I lost a rubber thing that goes on it. Where the hell? How? I'll put the other one in. It's not still my ear. And one hit. One hit. One hit. Are you kidding me? I was getting ready to like jump up and be like, whoa. We're going on our knees. We're on our knees now. Oh, wait. Is he going to die to our zone sandstorm? Oh, yeah, baby. Woo. And we pull off the W. IBA in their first ever tag lock. Pulls off the W together. We were rivals. Now we're a team. And we are pulling off this W. Now we are the champions of the Hoenn region. And you know what? I had the I had, I had champion here, right? Beat the champion here, and guess what? I'm going to become the champion of IBA Season 1. IBA did this one as a team, right? We did this one as a team, but guess what? We're going back to solo, and I'm going to grab a victory in Season 1 playoffs. I'm going to try. I'm going to try hard. You saw my A game. I felt like all season long my I, my A game wasn't there for some reason. I don't know. Feeling a little rusty maybe from draft league content from just battling content. Haven't done a lot of battling content on my channel. But you know what? You saw you saw week 8. If you haven't seen my week 8 battle. If you haven't seen any of the week 8 battles. Not just mine. Why am I saying mine? If you haven't seen the week 8 battles. Go check them out because they were hype. There was surprises in every battle of week eight between good matchups and just one of the closest games of iba season two that one's mine that one was mine uh the one of the closest games of iba season two uh was me and jv's battle probably one of the closest ones um if not the closest but definitely check out every week eight battle definitely check out all of our battles from week one through eight they were so good every single one of them was good Go and check them out. We got to make a massive playlist with everyone's battles. I think that's what we're going to do. Um, I have to update the playlist on my channel for everything. I think I have to del mass delete all my, uh, my uh, uh, playlists. And then remake all of them. Because <laughs> all my playlists are messed up. Especially my collab playlist. It has all of my episodes, but not the other guy's episodes. So I'm like, ah. <coughs> got to do something there. But yeah, just check out all of the IBA content. Like, we've had, we've had matches. We've had, well, we've had the weekly battles. We've had the teaser for this thing. We're going to have a teaser for season two. We're going to have, I'm, I'm probably making an announcement video on my channel for season two and stuff saying that we're interested. We're looking for people, blah, yada, yada, yada. And like run down how season two is going to be to see if people are going to be interested in it. Um, we're also going to have a teaser of season two going up on probably everybody's channels. And, yeah, keep your eye out for IBA Season 2. And like I said, if you're interested in IBA Season 2, hit me up on Twitter saying, hey, I'm interested in IBA Season 2. I think I might want to take you guys on. But, yeah. I mean, we're interested. Shout out to everybody that did compete in Season 1. Everybody in Season 1 is probably going to be back for Season 2. Everybody is reinvited back for Season 2. Um, It's a great group, the eight of us. 
me, Goki, Streamy, JV, Rebel, Kyogre, West, and Titan. All eight. Didn't even forget anybody. Oh, what a champion. Um, IBA Season 1 was honestly a great time. And shout out to all eight of those guys. Seven of those guys. Let's take myself out of there. Shout out to everybody that joined uh, Season 1. And thank you all for giving the thing, the Draft League a shot. Uh, one thing I am, one thing I was grateful for, and one thing I was worried about going into this is, they were getting hit up by this channel with thirty some odd subs. I had about thirty subscribers before the IBA started, uh, maybe even less. No, that's a lie. Uh, they were getting hit up by a channel with twenty subscribers. Twenty, a twenty subscriber channel, hit them up and was like, "Hey guys, I'm thinking about making a draft league. Would you guys be interested? It's a small YouTuber draft league." Would you guys be interested? And they were down. We were at 14 guys at one point, but with guys not being able to get capture cards or coming up with financial issues for a capture card or PC crashing, so many different things, um, guys left. But these, but us eight, we stayed together and they accepted the challenge to come into IBA from a guy with 20 subs, and that was what I was wor really worried about. And thanks to them, now I'm at uh, just under 60 subs from like them subbing to me and them exposing my channel in their videos and i think everybody everybody across all channels they grew a bit um but that wasn't the reason i was just thanking them for like being a part of this and taking a chance on a guy with 20 subs but iba season one that is going to be the end of it i'm going to let the cre credits roll us out of here because this is the end of the finale and you know what it was great uh, we ended up pulling up the dub in our first ever IBA tag lock. Who knows? Maybe there's going to be another one eventually. Um, I got ideas. Who knows if it's going to happen, though? But, um... Oh, it's going to go through all of our captures and stuff. But it was just a great... It was a great season with a great group of guys. And Season 2 cannot get here faster. Uh, be hyped. Playoffs are starting now. We gotta fit, say, I gotta say that season one's not done. We still got playoffs, and playoffs are gonna be hype. Um, but we are all looking forward to season two as well, redrafting with tiers, with more guys. More guys is always better, especially since drafting is gonna be so hard with, let's say, 16 people. Um, not 16. Yeah, I, I said I'd go up to probably max 16. But um, I don't think I'm going to go that high. <clears throat> I'd like to try to keep it under 14, probably. Because um, it's not just about the drafting. It's also about... Um, it's not just about, like, the limited amount of mods. It's also about... Uh, our draft takes place all at the same time. We all hop into a group call. It took us three hours this year. If we increase to 16, that's going to take us, like, six. We're going to have to start Saturday at, like, 2 p.m. And it's going to be, like, an all-day thing. Um... And it's just finding a time that works for everyone. Uh, we're going to have to make like a rule that if you don't attend draft, you either have to draft from the mons afterwards or you find somebody to draft for you. Something like that. But we're not going to worry about that right now. Just if you're interested in IBA Season 2, like I said, message me on Twitter saying you are down to join. And I don't know. Get hyped. Season one is coming to a close. The season's finally, the season is uh, over for season one. However, there are still playoffs. Be hyped for playoffs. Everybody is going to be bringing their A game. Um, and in case you don't know who's facing who in the IBA season two, uh, season one playoffs, well, the battles go up literally tomorrow. But in case you cannot wait, if you haven't seen the teaser for the IBA tag lock, go watch it because at the end of the tag, at the end of the teaser. I talk about season one playoffs like who's firsting who and I also say that season two I also do confirm like officially that season two is happening and that we are looking for people so to hit me up on Twitter um but yeah if you have not already checked out every other guy's uh channel that's part of the IBA please do all their links are in the description as well as a playlist to all the other episodes of the IBA randomizer pokemon emerald tag lock i said that in the worst possible way but yeah 
that's going to be it for this one, guys. Comment down below what you want to see for Season 2. Comment down below what you want to see for Season 2. Who do you want to see in Season 2? What would you like us to change slash add? And um, what did you think of Season 1? Oh, also comment what your favorite battle was and who your favorite coach was. That's going to be... And guys, in the IBA, you cannot comment yourself. Okay? Do not comment yourself. Comment who your favorite coach was besides yourself. But that's going to be it for this one, guys. I hope you did enjoy. And like this end screen is saying, this is the end of Season 1 of IBA. Now it's time for playoffs. But that's going to be it, boys, girls, cats, and squirrels. I hope you guys all did enjoy. And I will catch you in our next regular content. And I'll catch you in playoffs week 1 tomorrow, 10 a.m., EST across everybody's channel. That's going to be it. Hope you guys did enjoy it, and I'll catch you in the next one. Stay salty.